Today we're going to Hong Kong. It's an island. It's an island. There is this cable car that you take and it's like 15 minutes where you just go speeding through the whole island. Supposedly it's very beautiful. Let's find out. Kelly, you're excited? Hello, yes I am. I passed out on the ride here, but I'm fine now. Alright, you look so cute today, Thank Kelly. Thank you, Bethy. Okay, so we got a cab ride from the city center to the cable car. It was like 25 minutes, something like that. 275,000. Between four people, not too bad. So here's a map of Fukuok. This is the cable car we're gonna take. And it's gonna travel all the way through these islands. And it's gonna take us to this island over here. That's how it's gonna look like, man, I'm excited! My only concern is that I'm kind of afraid of heights, dude. So I hope this thing doesn't freak me out, man. Because in the past it has when I've taken them I think I took one in Australia and I fucking shit my pants, dude. <laughs> Price-wise, it's 450,000 per person. The cable car takes you to the island and the cable car brings you back. So it's 450 round trip. Are you afraid of heights? No. You're not? No, I'm fine. I am. I'm dude. not afraid of heights. I oh, am, I'm yeah. Not really? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I didn't know that. Yeah, yeah. So you're gonna have to hug me oh, really hard. Good. Yeah, okay. You afraid of heights? Uh, not really. No? Because I'm gonna be inside a cabin. Oh, we're gonna be inside a cabin? Yeah. What if I start shaking the cabin, bro? Just shake it. Just shake it. <laughs> oh, we're just going in. So they put us all in this little cabin car, right? <laughs> it's a big takeoff, dude. <laughs> 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 oh, And then, that, and then after that, we're gonna go to the water park. The water park has 21 different attractions, and we're gonna try them all. Is that right, Kelly? Yes, let's go to the water park. Guys, the spot we just arrived to is absolutely beautiful, man. What a spot! So they have a restaurant here with a buffet if you want to eat. Um, and then whenever you're done chilling here, they have some hammocks, they have some lawn chairs. Nah, uh, all that goodness for 450,000, I can't believe it guys. Seriously, the water. It's so clear. Actually, we saw some fish just swimming around and I didn't even have goggles. We also got on top of this jumping inflatable thing. So fun. And um, you don't have to pay for anything. Like the entrance includes everything and it's ridiculous. Kelly, what did you think of this place? How I love feel? it. I can spend all day in it. In fact, we might just sleep over yeah, in the bushes. Just, just stay here, go yeah, camp wake up, up tomorrow. There. Yeah, I think it might be possible. What do you, what do they call it? Like, get your prices right or like get your money worth it or something. Oh my god, you're so bad, Kelly, you're so bad. Fukuok has been an amazing island. Today I came here without really expecting much because I didn't know what I was going to find. But man, this place is totally worth it. If you guys come to Fukuok, you have to make a day out of this. It's really beautiful, especially if you have a family. I think it's a perfect spot for a family. And it's a decent price for 
everything that you get. Just make sure you come here. I would say earlier, I think I arrived a little bit too late to fully enjoy the whole experience. I don't understand how they keep it together, but it is impeccable, really. The grass is clean. I haven't seen anything really dirty. It doesn't, it doesn't, it feels like a really luxurious resort, really. Mm. It's, it's really They beautiful. pay attention to details. Yeah, so yeah. So far, um, I think the service has been really good. All the staff are really friendly and also, um, the lifeguards, they reminded all the kids to wear um, life jackets, which is really thoughtful because you don't see that a lot in Vietnam. Yeah, they have lifeguards and everything here. It's really cool, man. So the water park Aquatopia closes at 445, so we were too late, but man, I am so impressed on how this is built. It's actually a legit, wow, crazy water park. I haven't seen a water park like this in a while. It's, it's brand new, it's only like, I think a year and a half old, but oh my God. I'm gonna come back here again for sure, but guys, it's definitely worth it. You have to come here, come to this island, come to the water park, go on the cable car, it's extremely cool. And the best part is that the water park has a lazy river. I haven't seen a lazy river like this in a long time. Now we're gonna go get the cable car back to Fukuok Island. So that's it for today. As you guys know, I have a podcast where I interview expats around the world. And they explain to us how our life here is in Vietnam. I would really appreciate it if you can go check it out. Until next time, Christian Rodriguez, bye.